हेलो एंड वेलकम फ्रेंड्स दिस इज आनंद वेलकम टू माय चैनल कोडिंग विद आनंद एंड टुडे आई शो यू माय न्यू प्रोजेक्ट दैट इज बेस्ड ऑन क्लेम मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम दिस इज बेसिकली बेस्ड ऑन इंश्योरेंस क्लेम यू कैन रिलेट दिस प्रोग्राम विद लोन क्लेम्स और एनी अदर थिंग्स सो बैंक क्लेम्स और लोन क्लेम्स क्लेम्स और इंश्योरेंस क्लेम्स सो दिस इज सिंगल लॉग इन मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम so this is basically developed in spring boot and uh, database is mysql so uh, i'm using bootstrap in order to decorate the ui so there is only single login that is admin and uh, okay admin and the password so this is the admin dashboard so basically this contains that uh, we are basically registering all the members that are basically uh, requesting the claims related to the insurance and uh, total claim uh, claim processed or the pending claims and approved claims they are uh, uh, defined here so let's start with uh, creating a new member so let's start uh, i am going to create a new claim uh let's suppose anand singh this is 10 101999 and uh, address is let's suppose new delhi contact number we can define here email id anand@gmail.com gender nominee count so how many counts are there we can maximum of uh, three nominees uh, for the particular claim so insurance there are three type of insurance in this case the first one is the home insurance life insurance and vehicle insurance the insurance is basically uh, i can show you on my database okay i will show you in my sql workbench so this is basically created in spring boot so the database settings are defined here so the database name is claims management as you can see in the project so let's see so let's see the claims management and here are the tables so you can see there is only one user that is administrator and uh, the members that we have registered are displayed here all the information is stored in the database and uh, these are the insurance the different type of insurance the amount is fixed and the percentage uh, that will be claimed Uh, as per the insurance for example if we are claiming the home insurance the amount of insurance is 2 lakh and uh, there will be 91% of uh, uh, claim that is available life insurance is always 100% so vehicle insurance is 80% so that percentage can be directly updated inside the database uh, i haven't read the ui part for updation of uh, these information but uh, we can define here uh, if it requires so uh, if i choose home insurance it automatically fetch out uh, the insurance amount and the percentage is 91% so this is the 91% and if i'm talking about life insurance it is 10 lakh and it is 100% claimable and the vehicle insurance is 1 lakh but 80% of the amount is claimable so these are the scenarios that we basically have uh, done so let's save the member so this is the most important part that uh, the member id is generated automatically so we will copy this member id because we will search out uh, in other uh, areas uh, if i want to update any information this update member is also available this will contain all the uh, members who have uh, registered with the help of new member uh, section and uh, the uh, member id will be shorted accordingly the recent members will be displayed at the top and if i want to update any information we can directly update it let's suppose i want to update the information related to the city data and the phone number we can update it admin updated successfully and uh, you can see that uh, the information related to this one and this one is updated right now okay all are belongs to new delhi right no issues 
so this is updation related information now let's go to the claim request so as uh, we have already copied the member id uh, if i use a uh, invalid email uh, member id then it will display me that the member id does not exist you can see the data inside the members table is also uh, get update after in, uh, define the insurance uh, the member registration and uh, you can see now we are basically making a claim request first of all we basically register our new member for a particular claim and then the member id is generated accordingly and then we are basically getting the details from the claimer the member that why and what for what reason he is basically making the claim so if uh, he is talking about the uh, insurance this is basically a uh, one of the most important thing uh, this is basically handled by our uh, code so let me show you how they are managed uh, members no this is basically in control yeah so you can see if uh, we are talking about home insurance it will display me two options renovate and destroyed and if the insurance is a uh, vehicle insurance then it will display me repair and stolen and uh, if uh, the insurance is life insurance then it will be talking about treatment claim or that claim okay so accordingly uh, it will display me the amount let's say repair it is displaying that only 32,000 can be recovered and stolen then 56,000 can be uh, appealed okay so this is basically managed by the code uh, in the uh, gsp page part that uh, whatever values we have chosen uh, the percentage will be automatically calculated so let's create the request now the claim request has been done so uh, this is a search claim screen where we can search out the claim by their ids mbc dash zero 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 one one okay fine we are able to search it but if i want to find out by name we can let's suppose ajay we can find out anita we can find out so this can be done but uh, if you know the date with the help of date you want to search out you can uh, define the date criteria and it will be searched out accordingly okay so this claim is under process and uh, you can see that the claim is under process and uh, let's process this claim let's paste it the member id and you can see that now we are at the end stage of uh, claim process now everything is available who is the person who is making the claim for which insurance type the claim amount and the final claim amount uh, on the basis of reason that's what uh, that was made and uh, process response we can select if i say reject then it will ask me for the reason why it has been rejected and if i say approved then in order to approve the claim we need three document okay so uh, let's suppose i would like to add a tree document and submit claim so the claim processed successfully now if you uh, want to search the claim uh, again or you want to make the request then you can see that claim already created for this member id and uh, let's search out the claim process we cannot process the claim right now why because the uh, claim has already been processed so let's search so you can see that claim status is approved but what if we reject it so let's suppose uh, i create a new one uh, komal mehta and uh, 12121998 addresses let's suppose faidabad contact number and email id komal at the gmail.com email to insurance is let's suppose now well, i will choose life insurance okay update we can see new claim request and uh, this is to 
fine uh, you can see now we can see treatment claim that is 95 percent and death claim will be 100 percent so treatment claim i am talking about done and uh, we can see comal now it is available for pending process the claim to and let's enter and now if i reject this uh, treatment claim then document not provided or uh, for everything anything document not uh, correct let's submit it so when i process the claim and uh, let's search out accordingly Komal. and you can see it is rejected due to uh, document not correct so this is the whole process that uh, this particular uh, claim portal has done and uh, this is the claim management portal software so this is made in spring boot and uh, mysql and uh, if you like this project or you are looking for some changes and uh, some additions can be made if you are looking for some other projects to be created at my end i also created projects on demand so you can connect to me i am sharing my email id and contact number a whatsapp number on this description so you can go through and if you are new to this uh, channel please subscribe if you like my video like my project then please kindly subscribe my channel and uh, share it uh, so that your friends can come to me and uh, uh, find the solution to for their projects so thank you very much uh, I will come again for with my new software. Thank you. Thank you.